from breaking down myths to boosting people up. That's right, supporting federal workers is our first story trending now. And we want to make sure we feed their soul. Well, we all know that the partial government shutdown has taken quite a toll on hundreds of thousands of American workers. And in an effort to help out, restaurants and small businesses are dishing out freebies to feed our furloughed friends. Regular old Americans are chipping in too, buying workers a beer on payitfurloughed.com and donating cash. More than 1,800 campaigns have popped up on GoFundMe, raising over $400,000. We felt that there was something that we needed to do. And large companies like wireless providers are stepping up with flexible payment plans. Not even furry friends will be forgotten during this trying time. Humane societies are serving up the kibble to pet owners in need. A big blessing, it saves us a lot of money. Now another group of people who are not getting a paycheck, but most certainly earning one. Yeah, the super mom salary is at number two. I don't have any friends. Uh. I'm pretty isolated at home. I have four kids. Ah, uh, yes, and bad mom Kristen Bell is a chef, a janitor, a therapist. I mean, the list goes on and on. And those are just some of the many hats stay-at-home moms wear. Plus, they're usually dealing with rebellious, emotionally unstable clients, also known as their kids. And for all of that, they get paid nada. But according to Salary.com, if they did get a paycheck for their 24-7 every day of the year gig, it would come out to, wait for it, about 160 62 grand. The last time I had a good night's sleep. <laughs> I don't remember. The website hit that number by analyzing roles a stay-at-home mom takes on, like athletic director, tax accountant, and judge. Stay-at-home dads were not included in this, but we're pretty sure they'd get paid even more. You know, the gender wage gap and all. Yeah, we moms keep things on the rails, but not as literally as, say, a railway company. Uh-huh, making tracks on Amtrak is at number three. Somewhere in America, a train is boarding. And Amtrak wants you to be on one. Their Amtrak Take Me There program is giving people free train rides on some of their most scenic, long-distance routes around the country. The only catch, folks, you have to share your trip on social media. Welcome aboard. Thanks for riding with us today. Although the company says they're not looking for glitzy influencers with millions of followers, they do hope you're a leader in your social media community. Apply on Amtrak.com by January 31st. The winners will be announced on February 15th. We hope you ride again soon and we'll see you on the rails. Teresa, they do say slow travel is back in style. They do, but that might be too slow if you are traveling with young ones. Yeah, add travel coordinator to the list of unpaid mom duties, right? Yes. Yeah. And that's what's trending now.